Jamaica will be extending support to Nabi and Tourism Industry COVID program. This is being facilitated under a memorandum of understanding for tourism collaboration between the countries. It comes as authorities in the southwestern African country look to revamp up their revitalization efforts within the tourism industry, which suffered a significant fallout in occupancy and employment levels due to the pandemic. Tourism Minister Edmund Bartlett gave details during a meeting with the country's Minister of Presidential Affairs, Christine Hobbs, who ha headed a high-level government delegation on and visited the island. He said the focus areas include sustainability, resilience, and destination assurance. I believe we can make very strong uh, strides together with, with sustainability and resilience. Yeah. And the, to that extent, um, we will uh, work with you to establish the uh, Global Tourism and Resilience uh, Crisis Management Center in uh, Namibia. The center, which is headquartered at the University of the West Indies, Mona Campus, is designed to help vulnerable countries globally to recover quickly from natural disasters. It targets destination, preparedness, management, and recovery from disruptions and or crises that threaten economies and livelihoods globally with real-time data and effective communication. Namibia's Minister of Presidential Affairs said the agreement will strengthen collaboration between the countries and unlock some of the opportunities being experienced by Jamaica. This agreement is so important for us so that we can look into the possibility of how to streamline the, 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 the ships that are landing here to also pass through Namibia. 